What's up, Killer Clan? Welcome to the video. Today's a special day. Not only is it a Giant Foods episode, but it's also Thanksgiving. Yes, it's a Thanksgiving celebration on Giant Foods. And as you can see from back there, I got one of my classic baguette rolls. It's almost five foot long. Because we're making a Thanksgiving feast sub sandwich challenge today. Turkey and ham, mashed potatoes, gravy, stuffing. All the staples on one big huge sandwich. Let's put it together. We switched it up. We went with Sam's Club baguette, French. Something different. It's not our traditional Walmart stuff, Mr. Fool. Look no, at these things. No, this thing. Yeah. I was actually mistaken in the intro. It's actually four foot long, not five. Cause these are just, just about two foot a piece. It's gonna be a big sandwich. Yeah, it is. But that's what we do, Mr. Pool. It's what we do. Here's our bottom of this one. Foundation, Mr. Pool. Now we have this absolute tray of deliciousness. You better get in on that. Better get in on that. Look at that. I probably should. You know you want to zoom in on that. We got a little over a pound of ham here and we're gonna go ahead and start layering this on. Whew, that is hot. As you can see. It's good and juicy too. Juicy meat, yeah. Some juicy meat. Cause what other kind is there? That in there, so we got turkey on there. I think I should put the pulled turkey right on top of the ham. Or you think I should separate it with something? I would say all the meat's down, then build. Right? Yeah, probably. Now, I don't know how this is actually going to stack. I'm going to try. Let it look for the either. Massively dry. <laughs> ah, I mean, it's, it's definitely moist. I mean, mm. I mean, look at the water in the tray. I mean, it's, yeah, that, that could have been from the hand. Yeah. Ouch. Hey, it's definitely, uh... Mm-mm. Oh, you better get some of that. Go ahead. Treat yourself to a little piece. It won't kill you in the comments too bad. No. That's good, right? That is good. Some of the best tasting turkey I've ever had. All right, so we got this all pulled. Ha, pulled. Ha. Andy pulled. Now let's see if we can somehow make this work. It's a lot of dirty. Yeah, it is. That's how it came packaged, so that's what we ended up with. We got that good mix of dark, dark meat, white meat. No discrimination, we got it all in there. Comment below if you're a dark meat fan or a white meat fan. I actually prefer the dark because. It's not dry. It's usually not dry. Yes, exactly. 
that's usually that is the case. Turning into a heck of a sandwich. <laughs> yeah, it is. They all kind of turn into one big, big, huge sandwich. They didn't have any Every place in the <laughs> brother was sold out. Now, I know you guys are kind of disappointed. This isn't a traditional because you can't. You don't really like make this stuff. You just kind of like cook it. So it would be kind of boring to watch me like make the turkey and stick it in the oven, and then we just like watch it through the window for like five hours. So. This cornbread stuffing. I think this is actually made by Pepperidge Farm. And Andy Cole. It's never had cornbread stuffing. It definitely, definitely has a, a good smell to it. If you like cornbread muffins, that's where it's at. If you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. You gonna eat your cornbread? You gonna eat your cornbread? That's good. Just add a little sample. This thing's getting epic, dude. It's turning into a pretty big sandwich right there. Yeah, it is. Should have brought in two by six. Slap that sucker on there. I sure. Mashed potato sandwich. Mashed potato sandwich. Technique. Mashed potato sandwich. Pretty much. Mashed potato sandwich. Get the little thing. You got a big clump down here. We all know that no, <clears throat> we all know that no Thanksgiving feast is complete without gravy. So you're gonna want to, you're gonna want to get in on this. This right here is where it's at. Oh yeah. There it is, Mr. Pool. There it is. The world's largest Thanksgiving feast submarine. <sighs> All right, Killer right, Clan. So, as you saw in the previous clips there, Mr. Pool and myself went ahead and assembled this thing. It's a monster. It's over four foot long. I mean, look at my baddie. That's how John Mayer would say it, baddie. I'm like, this section and this section both are wider than my baddie. It's got all your staples. You got ham, you got turkey, you got mashed potatoes, you got stuffing, and you got gravy on this huge four foot baguette. So happy Thanksgiving. I hope you enjoyed it with your family. I'm enjoying it with Mr. Pool and uh, plus, who are we kidding? I'm definitely still gonna eat at my mom and dad's, but we're getting warmed up with this big monster. This thing comes in at around 11 pounds. It's got four pounds of turkey alone on it. A pound of ham, 
two pounds of mashed potatoes, three-ish pounds of stuffing, and the roll weighs almost two pounds. So Without we're further go. ado, the largest Thanksgiving submarine ever constructed. So this has been done before. Eric the Electric did it. There's been a few other people that have done it. I think, actually, I think Subway offered this. Subway used to offer like a Thanksgiving sub. But I know Eric made a version of it too, and it was like maybe like this big. But this is a killer sized version. So without further ado, three, two, one, happy Thanksgiving. I don't know how long this is gonna take, but I'm gonna actually try to cut this and eat it like a sandwich for once. I don't know if it's gonna go, Mr. Cole. We're gonna try it, right? I think you can do it. We're gonna give it a go. Oh my goodness, look at that. Lay him all the stables. Here we go. Mm. It's chewable. It's big. It's delicious. Anderson's already trying to get some. You have to like cradle it like a baby so you don't lose everything. Whoop. Like that. Hand jumping out. <clears throat> this thing is a beast. We all know that would have made a mess. Now that's a Thanksgiving sub. It smells gross. It smells like Thanksgiving. <clears throat> Each section's like a pound. <laughs> How much did it weigh total? I love them. That's what your plate looks like on Thanksgiving anyway. Mm-hmm, yeah. <laughs> Carbo stopped by. Don't stop by. It's my house. She stopped by. Okay. She's stealing stuff. It's not Anderson's time to shine yet. Yeah, it is. It's mm -hmm. always time to shine. No. Nope. There's a lot. <laughs> Not that there's like a form of french fry, because it's good. The french fries dipped in mashed potatoes is delicious. Mm -hmm. There's something wrong with you. It's finger looking good so far. You have to test it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Find that piece right with mashed potatoes on it. He's a weirdo. It's so good. What about the other one? It's okay. Mr. Poole must not have wanted to enjoy the Thanksgiving submarine challenge. He left. I should have toasted this or something. That made it harder. Mm -hmm. Make it it's crunchy. It's not chewy though. Oh. Yeah. That's why I had to do it at the end of the peanut butter and jelly thing. <laughs> that was awful. <laughs> I know what I can use to eat this with. Down. Hey! <laughs> I 
I was playing with those the other day <laughs> whenever they were sitting on the Anderson. Shout out to Sandy, aka Irish underscore girl on Instagram, for sending me these utensils. Look how big this thing is. It's a monster. I got a big mouth, Todd. <laughs> Mac potatoes are gross. Hi, Gooser. I don't even like potatoes. I see more creep. It's like a shovel. That's all stuffing. Corn <laughs> <clears throat> stuffing. Thanksgiving guy. The feast is bigger at Thanksgiving. No, really? <laughs> Not at Nan's. It's like about the same. They <clears throat> won't even be home for Christmas this year. I guess that's what they were trying to go to Heather. <clears throat> Christmas is canceled. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, I'll get you to go back. How good I can take a gift bag? I get. Yep. Mercedes, she's too stupid to know what's going on. That piece of ham here is stuffed full. That is not true. And Anderson, <clears throat> I don't know where his puppy went, so we can't play with that anymore. His what? His puppy. No puppy. The little black dogs. Yeah, they're in the trash can. I never played with them. Every day after school, we played with them. When mother still lived here, because that was the other way to distract me. Four years ago. Four years ago. I haven't seen them since she lived here. I got rid of all the dogs. What about Kitty? <clears throat> I knew exactly what I thought. I never seen you play with Kitty. You want to see Mercedes get real mean. Mm-hmm. Keep that kid. thing with her life. Let's talk about Kitty after my video is over. This baguette's like... They're betting in the background who's going to eat more on Thanksgiving. I'm not part of the equation. I can find you. It takes a lot of sacrifice and a lot of dedication. Got another Thanksgiving staple over here. Iced tea. There's nothing like a good fresh pot of brewed tea. We're 15 minutes into this beast. You know, a trick behind competitive eating gray right here. Oh. 
wants to see Anderson get on the table and just <clears throat> Kobayashi this thing. I don't. I'll rush one for it. Give her two pounds. <clears throat> Here you go, Anderson. Satisfied? Yeah. Give the carbo some of this mashed potatoes because she loves mashed potatoes. I, I don't really care for mashed potatoes that much. I bypass the potatoes, go straight to the noodles every time. You know what's better than mashed potatoes? Throwing them in the trash? Mashed potatoes and noodles together. Oops. No lumps in these taters. That's what I like about mom's mashed potatoes and lumpy. Comment below. Lumpy or no lumps. Mm -hmm. so much stuffing. Okay. So theoretically, it take you have more space if you have bread in your stomach and you drink. No, it still takes up the same amount of space. This will hold the exact same amount of mashed potatoes as it will water by volume. Yeah. No. <laughs> We're doing a math lesson in the back in the uh, behind the scenes here. She's slowing me down. Wait till after. I'm gonna get this thing done. I felt dead because I got rid of my Lilo. I did the whole 24 pounds is 24 pounds. That's as much as I can eat. Yes, that's Where what I'm are? saying. But yeah. you just said the volume. Which is... What I'm saying is if I take that piece of bread and you shove it down your And head. I swallow the bread, then I drink X amount of water. <laughs> Anderson's gonna get lucky two times in this town. Big piece of turkey from a boy right here. Premium turkey. It's so good it almost doesn't even taste like turkey. You can't really tell the difference. Turkey and chicken taste the same. That is all stuffing with a little bit of mashed potato left. Hmm? Mm. Got one for him. Yeah, I think more to go with Turkey meatball. <clears throat> mm -hmm. 
<clears throat> Last handful of turkey break, Jesus. <sighs> so much turkey. No, I got less a ham sandwich. A half an hour ham. Hmm? That's what TikTok would do. They like set it on their nightstand, like behind them, and they like. Yeah. I shouldn't drag him a swallow of water. <clears throat> and dry. Seventeen. Wow. Alright, so there you have it. The largest Thanksgiving sub challenge ever crafted and completed. I have no idea how big it was. 12, 13 pounds. I forgot there was 3 pounds of broth in the stuffing. But there you have it. I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving. I hope you gobble till you wobble and subscribe and follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at the Killer Kennedy. T-shirts and decals available. Link below. I hope you're thankful for something. I'm thankful that sandwich is done because that got rough. Until next time, take it easy. <laughs>